Three people are missing after floods swept away their houses at Arson Village in Sambaru North Sub County. Sambaru County Canada Red Cross Coordinator Morris Onengo said his team is on the ground working with the community to trace the missing people. Speaking on Wednesday, Mr. Onengo said 15 other households have also been affected by the ongoing floods. We are doing a detailed assessment that will inform us on the level of effects of the floods at the village and possible response options, he said. Residents living on the lower areas have been called upon to be extra vigilant and move to other raised places in order to avoid loss of lives and property. According to the Meteorological Department, there is information that trains will still go on and especially those who are living at the low areas we are requesting that they be vigilant and if possible they move to higher ground so that their safety can be guaranteed, he advised. Unknown number of livestock have also been swept away by the floods. Recently, Sambaru North residents had called upon county government to lobby for funds from national government to invest in construction of water dams along River Baragoy and Sambaru North to harvest rainwater. According to the residents, construction of at least two to four water dams along the river will enable them harvester and preserve enough rainfall for domestic, irrigation and watering livestock in future. Permanent Secretary in Charge of Crop Production at the Ministry of Agriculture Dr. Richard Lessiemp said there is a need for national and county governments to work together to harvest and preserve rainwater in areas that are receiving heavy rainfall across the county. He said national government will support the county government in the next financial year to construct small water dams to harvest water for use during drought. We have made plans of ensuring that we have built small water dams in every village so that residents can save the rainwater and preserve the commodity for use during drought season, he said.